Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to episode number 26 in the Brighton and Hove Albion career mode. Now this episode we're going to start our Champions League campaign. We're going to play Villarreal and possibly Newcastle, possibly Leicester, possibly Man City. We will see. Mad trip. What? What do you mean? Oh my god, S2G had this glitch. Are you kidding me? Are you sure you want to continue? This is crazy. No, I'm, I, I know how to fix this glitch. You have to go here and you have to send past the game. This is the only way to fix this glitch. It's happened. And we win, luckily. Thank goodness. Now we got a game in the Premier League. Yeah, see, look, it's a glitch. It's because of the... They, Remove the Russian teams, and it's a glitch. Adam Webster, you know what? I'm gonna just accept it. That's an extra thirty million. Wesley, I can't believe he's only eighty-two. He could, he could have been insane. Pellegrini, Ronaldo's only. He's still eighty-six or eighty. That's insane. <clears throat> We're playing Newcastle. They're the worst team in the league. Fitness issues for sure. Patrick Bamford. Seems like Lamptey could use a break. Gabriel for sure. I'll keep Malasia. Keep Basuma. I'll give Cibayo. So yeah, and I'm going to go like that. Quick swimming it versus Newcastle. We should still win. And we do. Cibayos and Seymour score the winning goals. <clears throat> You know what? I'm gonna actually give Oats this Oats card guy. He's asking for a game. Konsa is exhausted. He could use a break. I wanna see what he's all about. Melasia tired. I'm gonna give Solly March a game because last time I played Alonzo, it didn't turn out too well. Basuma tired. See, Bios was tired as well. Looks like Azalete is going to get a game. Sima, this is a big rotation, but <clears throat> we need it, honestly. There we go. Oh, Luis Diaz is tired, too. Never mind. This is a very rotated team, but we still have more than enough quality on the field to beat Leicester City in the cup. I want to win the cup this year. Hello and a warm welcome this game is at home. We have home field advantage. Let's do this. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to Here's Simon, who started off the season very well. Against Leicester City. Well, there's nothing like a good cup run to boost confidence. And these two teams will be hoping this could be their year to win this tournament. Yes, there's a long way to go, but this is still a... Solly March, that's good defending. And Yaki Williams is... Oh, he's not going to be able to play the full 90. Using his physical strength to shield it. Can he make it count? Oh, wow. Our defense just got destroyed. I should have played Connolly for this game. But we needed him out there. We needed Gabriel out there too. We needed some players. This is still Leicester at the end of the day. Sima. Sima, it's 1 1 versus Leicester City. This is a good game. Hopefully we can just make it like 3-1, 4-1 and wrap it up. Corner of line, Sima is the danger man. I think they're going to start figuring that out very fast. I love how tight we're marking. We're going to need a sub off Lamptey, Gabriel, and... Yaki for this game. Next up, we got Man City, and that's never an easy test. 
Eric Lamptey yeah, running down the line. I'm just going to use his pace versus Scott McTominay. Well, he failed to get it away properly. The defending. I think the threat has been averted. Gabriel. Ducker. Good stuff from Conrad Limer. Oats oh, garbage. Oh, Oats guard so far not been too impressive. But he's got to play since he has. Since next up is Man City, like I said. And it's okay, we'll have someone else come off the bench to for Gabriel, so it's okay. I should have maybe put Veltman on the bench. Instead of taking him off, I took him off the bench. So I could put Gabriel on there. Oh, come on, come on! That's a bit dirt. No, sorry, Konsa on there. Because Konsa is not in the lineup. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Can they take the lead here? Azalete! 2 1 versus Leicester City. Let's go. We are in cruise control of this game, I'd say. Make it 3 1, maybe 4 1. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. The boxes get us moving again. A swift reply required after the setback. And the timing was perfect. 4 1. And the emphasis is on creativity. And options in the center. A decisive clearance it was. And he read it well defensively. Come on, come on. Switch to. What is happening? I can't switch to Oats Guard. Lamptey clears it down. That's very good refereeing to let the play flow. The delivery. Struggling to get it away. Nicely timed tackle. Real chance. What a save from Robert Sanchez and a good block by Oatsgar. That was crazy. Mitoma. Chance to whip it in here. Cross towards that far post. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Really good challenge. Dennis Bryant. Oh, that's a big mistake from Oats guard, but he made up for it. Limer, Mitoma. The ball lost here. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. He goes short. Oatscar, that's good defending. Well, not hard to read that pass. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next, and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Fantastic save from Robert Sanchez. Not a corner here, and that might boost their hopes. That's well blocked. A 
Well, as the stats tell us, Brighton have been second best in terms of possession, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Good save by Robert Sanchez, who's been making save after save in this series. And they have possession again. Sully March had an okay game. Possibilities in the center. Marcus Tuham. Ross could be useful. Robert Sanchez came out and make it made himself big. Half time. Here two one up over Leicester City. Let's make it 3-1 and then finish this game off. Sima is that danger man for us tonight. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Defenders need to cover. Oh my god, the Casper Dolberg comes on and scores. Come on. Let's not get eliminated in the Carabao Cup this early. Over the bar. From Sima there. Indeed he's coming on. Brendan Rogers is not wasting any time. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Brighton and Hove Albion facing Manchester City. Not the best challenge, free kick. Azalete with a good challenge. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Space and time for the cross. Oh surely. Oh my god, get it away. How lucky was that? Robert Sancho just had to get a little touch on it. Oh, Dolberg is dominating our defense. We might have to Can he give them the lead? And bring in Ezra Iconsa at this rate because it's getting bad. Oh, Sima turns, plays it through to Bamford. Not the quickest of players, but he's pretty fast. Inyaki Williams, who's had a quiet game with a huge miss there. Honestly, he may just maybe need to make some changes at this point. I think we do need right now something special in Luis Diaz. And then I think we honestly need... Let's give Shackle... No, sh I'll bring on Konsa in a little bit. Let's play you there as center back, Shackleton. Because Oatsgaard is having a hard time dealing with Dolberg. Oh, Conrad Limer. Gabriel. He had a job to do there, but he had two players and he didn't go for the challenge. Oh, wow. Yeah, Luis Diaz is about to get, he's, he needs to just, we just need to get him on the ball, honestly. That's it. That's all we need. And I truly believe with just getting him and Inyaki more involved, we will win this game. Mauro Arambari. Leicester moving the ball with purpose. What a save from Robert Sanchez, who's keeping us alive in this game. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. 
he read that brilliantly well what a great save that was to keep them in this may just be the impetus they need as they certainly have in Yaki, come on tries to play through to Bamford over the top yes it's a free kick and for this I think I know what I'm gonna do does Inyaki honestly have the best free kicks in our team? I want to give it a go with Luis Diaz. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. Oh my god, Luis Diaz with another fantastic attempt there. Luis Diaz plays it in, cleared away. Oh. Now they might just be able to catch us on the counter. Twenty minutes to go. Oh, and <laughs> Honestly, I'll throw in Malasia. Malasia is a game changer for us. How are we getting beaten so easily? 4-2. We just cannot cope with that Leicester City attack. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Come on. Danjuma is dangerous on the attack, but so be it. We could Oh, Inyaki. Oh my god, Inyaki completely missed a huge chance. He could have won that tackle off of Melier. Oh, come on. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Leicester City facing Southampton. Mauro Arambari. Now with Turam. Klosterman. Now let's see about the cross. Dolberg makes it 5-2. Oh my gosh. Dolberg came on for I don't know who at halftime, but he has changed the game for them. We are just getting stopped everywhere. Come on. I mean, it's game over. I don't know why I'm trying, but. Luis Diaz. And he read it superbly. You know what? I'm just going to call it for this game. 5 2 loss. Okay, we're out of the Carabao Cup. Big deal. We'll get them in the FA Cup. Webster has been sold and add an extra 30, 15, 12 million to our budget, almost 30 million. There's some good looking free agents, not gonna lie. Yo, these, this one looks good. No, this guy not so much. This Miranda guy, he looked good. So I just scouted him. I'm just, I was just, I'm just curious on these guys. Kai Smart guy too. Bunch of players. Now I got a game versus Man City, which we need to win. Strongest 11. We got Rafinha and Luis Diaz. They're going to be up against tough opponents like Jao Cancelo. Possibly even Kyle Walker. Yep, Limer, Basuma. They got to have a big performance as well. Hello and a warm welcome from the south coast of England. This is the scene here in Brighton. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Brighton facing... Hey, yo, Rafinha got taken out there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's slow things down a little bit. Let's get the ball back. We'll win the game. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. Intense pressure. Oh, 
I was like, come on, that's a penalty it is. Let's go. I'm going to take this with Ganesh. And I'm just going to go to place it. Gedesh missed another penalty. We got to make it up from this corner, though. Rafinha Consad couldn't quite stretch and grab it. Tarek Lamptey should win that in the air. Yes, he does. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Crossing possibilities. Showing a lot of guile. Rafinha showing some real promise there. Yedesh, what a big block that is. Now this is Rafinha's time to shine. Come on. Yedesh is checking in this time. Here's Goncalo Yedesh. Supposedly at the back post was Konsa. It didn't work out. Keeper, just come off. Robert Sanchez has it. Oh, mistake, mistake. Oh, I didn't see that Man City player. Ah, uh, sliding in to try to just get a poke on it. Oh, wow, that was a bad pass from Loris. And Luis Diaz gets past his defender, but Ruben Diaz is going to be a big test tonight because I know he could beat that right back all night long. But just, can he beat Ruben Diaz? If he can, good. But if he cannot, we'll struggle. Good stuff from Robert Sanchez to make himself big. Malasia there with the huge challenge. And Consa, luckily, is fast. Look at him go. Look at him go. Okay, now Luis Diaz has a 1v. He's just offside. Inyaki's chasing down Ruben Diaz. Luis Diaz! Wow, how close was that to score? How close was he to scoring there? Bernardo Silva. The ball with Rodri. Come on. Consa. Tara Clamty. Cromerich is going to be pretty easy to defend. If it was like Erling Holland or something, different story, but. It's not, so we are a bit lucky. Inyaki. Header cleared away. Limer. Malasia. Gedesh makes it 1 0. Goncalo Gedesh there with a brilliant finish. What a ball from Malasia, who is honestly just doing so well in a Brighton shirt. He has just thrived since game one. Come on, let's make it two. Let's let's put Man City to bed. Let's get Rafinha a goal. Rafinha has done well tonight in this game so far. He's got Bernardo on him. He loses Bernardo and Jao Cancelo. He plays it through to Gedesh, and how? How has Ederson saved that? Rafinha checks in. Consa! As, oh no, that's Gabriel! Gabriel gets his first goal in a Brighton and Hove Albion shirt. Let's go. We are playing fantastic tonight. Controlling the game. Rafinha is really starting to find his feet. Our wingers are just so good. Cromerich, what a terrible signing for Man City. No disrespect to Cromerich, but it's he's very easy to defend on this game. Maybe not in real life, but on this game he is. What a save from Robert Sanchez. And why am I dribbling? I just got to clear it. That looked painful. This game is starting to get ugly. 
Malasia. We got Luis Diaz in space. Then we got Inyaki. Then we got Goncalo Gedesh, and it goes in, crosses the line. It's a brace for Gedesh. Yeah, game over. 3 1 win. And surely, hopefully, that puts us top of the league. Let's see what happens. We'll see after this. Let's see if, he, see if we can play this game. Hey, we won 3 0 for top of our group. What the? There we go. Why is it only showing? There we go. We are tied with Man United. Who's in dead last? Sheffield. Okay, not a surprise. Who's top scorer? Sancho with seven, but this is Everton. I think, honestly, we could simulate this game with a couple rotations. I'll let Gedish play. I'll put Bamford in. I'll put... I'll give Ceballos. No, you know what? Let's start Basuma. I'll give Ceballos a game. I'll take... I'll give Sima a game. And I'll give Veltman a game. Why not? Let's make sure the bench is good so we have options. That's the best bench we can go with. Quick simming this versus right, uh, Everton. We win a 2-1. Bamford with a brace. Reed Charlson missed the pen. We're doing well in the prem. We are unbeaten. Not unbeaten. We've been beaten once. But we are top of the league by three points. Wait, who are all these players that have been scouted? Okay, so this Fernandez guy is 80, 73 rated. Kai's smart. Dang, we missed out on such a big backup striker. Miguel Gonzalez. Contract expiring. Maybe in January we sign him on a pre-contract deal. And then next year we'll sell a little Ceballos. But we don't know. Nico would be a good one, but we don't need it, these, any of these guys. I'll keep my eyes though on Nico. I'll put him in my short list. Now, what is our next game? Versus Tottenham Hotspur. Kai Scott Smart. How much is he worth? 18 million. Oh, wow. He would have been a good back striker, but he wouldn't be as good as ours. But Going with my strongest 11 versus Spurs. Sure, I guess we can fix it. I guess someone got injured. But I don't know who. So yeah, let's figure it out. We'll figure it out. We're at home at the Amex Stadium. This should be an easy, easy three points. Our record against Spurs is very good. Rafinha is in the f is starting to pick up some really good form. So let's do it. He took on pretty much, you could say, the whole defense there. Rafinha, it's blocked. It's a goal kick? Gabriel, up you go. What a block, what a block. Lime air with a nice clearance. Basuma, Rafinha, Gedesh is now up to an 86. Oh, Luis Diaz, he's got a field day versus Dort. Okay, maybe not then, but I honestly think he's going to have a field day versus Matt Doherty. Inyaki, look at how many Spurs players there are. But Inyaki Williams is insane, and he's still blasted into the roof of the net. Let's go. 1-0 up versus Spurs. And we are a dangerous team, I believe, this season. A big win here could put us possibly... Oh, Ben... Do what? Wait, what did Robert Sanchez do? That was... Oh my god, I was trying to call him off, but... 
I guess I pressed the wrong button. I don't know what. Luis Diaz, come on, get your act together, my, my dude. Luis Diaz. Get cuts it inside on Doherty. Goncalo Gedish. Basuma, how is the keeper? Save that! But Basuma still wins the header and makes it 2 1 versus Tottenham Hotspur. Basuma is insane. Wait, how about how? Who's our highest rated player? I think it's Luis Diaz. Okay, second place it's Gedish, Rafinha, and Sanchez. No, second place is Basuma. And then it's Sanchez, Gedish, and Rafinha. Then it's Gabriel Consa. And then it's Malasi and, and Limer. And then lowest rated is Lamptey, which we may improve the right back next season if we're, there is a next season. But so Tarek Lamptey does the job, so I don't even know if we need to sell him. First goal of the season, by the way, for the former captain, Basuma. And Yaki seems to be in really good form tonight. Malasia. Playing with purpose and control. Pulls it back. Luis Diaz just flies by the defenders, but there's no way Rafinha's winning a battle in the air versus Jules Kunde. Money prevented it from going over the line. Well, the hosts will be determined to claim all three points. Gabriel, good defending. Yeah, we are tied with Man United at the top of the league. Oh, Inyaki. So much space to exploit. Gadesh, it's blocked by Kunde. Maybe I should have gone for the chip or cut it. Cut it back. And we have a goal to update you on in the Brentford game. Let's hear all about it from Alex Scott. It's a goal for Southampton. It's now one minute, 23 minutes play. Thank you, Alex. Oh, Robert Sanchez and with a good save. Luis Diaz. Here goes Malasia. Undoubtedly the sort of player who can get fans off their seats. What do you think we should look forward to seeing from him today, Stuart? Well, he's certainly on fire. Ryan Sessignon, what a left back he is. He's just been too hot to handle. And I fully expect him to score again today and eventually break that record. Luis Diaz cannot quite get there. Keeping the ball moving. Gabriel, he can keep up. Oh. Well, I think a classic. Luis Diaz wins it back. Inyaki oh, Williams opens up his body. 3 1 versus Spurs. We are cruising to victory yet again. No shortage of goals on this match. 3 1. Okay, let's just make it 4 1. I, I, we can wind it, we might as well simulate this game. It's good defending. From Gabriel, who I think was just what we needed in this team. I think Gabriel and that right winger honestly helped. I think the defender, honestly, though, was that final touch missing. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. Bisuma. And giving it away. Hyung Min Son. Who? Oh. Come on. Sessignon beats Konsa. What a save and 3 2. Come on. On with the game then. 3 2. What will happen next? He's beaten his man. Can he play it in? 
Spurs are kind of taking control a little bit, and I'm not going to let that happen. Lucas. Matt Doherty. Lucas with it. Luis Diaz, I think that's a smart foul I made. Winks. It's with Cody Bali. Kunde. In terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Great vision from oh, Tarek Lampy, look at how fast he is. He just kept up with Son like it's nothing. What a save from Robert Sanchez, who has made some insane saves tonight. Now sending us in. Kulabali. Mal wow, Kane maybe just maybe should have scored that. We called him really far out, so you never know. Now, who's the. Something happened with Cibayo, so I don't know if he got injured, but. Connolly's on the bench. I might give him some game time in a little bit, but you'll likely see Sima. Maybe, maybe Mitoma I left back. And away they go again. What to do for Spurs in this second half. Brian, Brian Heal. Oh, Malasia's got a little bit more work to do. Well, they want the ball back quickly. Kane. Oh wow, Spurs have got back into it. Brian Heal, he's dangerous, you can just tell. We can't complain about a lack of entertainment. Three three. Oh what is happening here in this game? Benton Cool. Harry Winks now. Given away by Tottenham. And Yaki. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And under no real pressure as he brought the ball down. Heel. Doherty has it. That's good Regain defending position. by Gabriel. All his defensive acumen to cut it out. Benton Poor. Now Son. Kane. Really getting stuck in. Come on. Mm. I think we need a little bit of change in this game. And I think someone likes, you know, would be good. Rafinha has been a little... You know what? I want to try something out. I want to see how this works. Play him a little bit as I can. And then go with this formation a little bit. And then we'll have to play Basuma here. Sort of like this formation, but... I just want to see how this works out. Maybe... Good stuff from Tarek Lamptey. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Well read to ease the pressure. Well, it's been such a good game so far. Chances and goals at both ends, and all played at a great tempo. It's certainly been a good watch. Konsa gets there easy peasy. Luis Diaz is getting the yellow card. Rafinha. Oh, this this is a key good looking run. And the cross is very much on. Good tackle. Now, you know what? I'm going to give this a go. We need a left footer on this. I'm going to give this a go with Pancalo. That's a good looking one. Free kick. It's just wide. I think if that was on target, maybe Ramiro would be tested there. Consa. 
Oh, Basuma. What a save from Robert Sanchez. And Malasia, smart, just clear it out of bounds. Oh. Goncalo Gedesh. Oh, good play, this. Well, bumped clear. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. We need something to change this game, but it's not. I'm going to give Connolly a go. This might be a mistake, but I'm taking off Inyaki. And I'm going to see what Connolly can do. This is this is a pretty big mistake, isn't it? But hey, we still have Goncalo in there. But Connolly won the, the very few games I've given him. He has actually done well. Surprise, surprise. Davis. Winks. Now Harry Kane. Spurs pushing forward with options available. Oh, Robert Sanchez with the big save. And Rafinha, could he start a counterattack? He gets taken out by Hyung Min Son from behind. Are you kidding me? He's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Isuma. Still passing it around with authority. Aaron Connolly! The substitute gives us the lead here versus Tottenham Hotspur. Oh my goodness. Let's go! <clears throat> Woo! And a composed finish under pressure. That's a top class goal. Here's young man Son. Robert Sanchez with the big catch. Now here it goes, Connolly. Ten minutes left for play. Goncalo. Could this be the final touch in this game? situation has changed in the Brentford game to what extent Alex Scott Kane Brian Hill I see a space Gabriel you got to commit and Gabriel takes him out uh, that was a dangerous challenge for sure oh what a blunder from Robert Sanchez he has absolutely bottled that. He completely missed the punch. We are back at 4-4. We need to keep up with Man U. Connolly, Luis Diaz now. He's starting a very promising counterattack. In the middle. Sima! 92nd minute. It's who else but Sima to get the game winner versus Spurs. This man is insane. Here comes everyone off the bench. Where's Inyaki? Where's Inyaki? Where's all those subs? Let's go. Victory secured. Full time. 5-4 win versus Tottenham Hotspur. This was a brilliant game.
let's see, can we play this game? Oh, we won 3-0. We are legitimately, actually, oh, we're three points clear to top of the league. Let's go. Southampton, they're 17. What's after this? Okay. You left me out. Oh, Seamal's disappointed, but I will play Sema. And you know what? I'll give Alonzo a game, because why not? I'm going to simulate this game. 1-1 one, one draw. Are you kidding me? We had our best team out there, pretty much. And we draw that game. We're still top of the league, but just by one point, though. Okay, I should fix up the bench a little bit. Why is Chef Peen on here? I'll take him off. And why not put Alonzo on there? Like, why not? Where's Sully March? Oh, why don't I just put Sully March on the bench? Next up is Burnley. We'll play them next episode. That's going to be all, though, for today's episode. So, thanks for watching. Make sure to like button down below and subscribe to my channel. The comments are going to be on. So, write some by.